The theme of Krishna's book, Living a Life That Matters, is that we all need to and want and should live lives that count. Each human being should live a life that really matters, that has a difference. But we often pursue means to accomplish that goal to leave us feeling guilty. In the opening chapter of his book, he describes two worlds that we inhabit. One is a world of work and commerce and eating and doing things that we have to do just to get through the day. In this world, the winners are usually praised. And if you don't win, you're usually condemned or put down. The need to succeed often drives us to acquire certain status symbols like prestigious titles, wanting first class tickets, or having ourselves praised in some way. This causes us pleasure when somebody says something nice about us. And when they don't recognize us, we, we feel put down, or we don't feel as good, or we react to it in some way or another. It also explains why so many of us spend a lot of our lives trying to get the attention, say, of our parents and uh, significant authority figures in our lives. Krishna remembers one time paying a, a condolence call on a member of his church who would, whose father has, had died. And when he went, met with the man, the man immediately broke down in tears. And he said to Krishna, he said, you know, my dad was a great man, and I did a lot of things in my life. I went to the best schools. I, I had good achievements in my marriage and my children. But never once in my life, he said, did my dad recognize me for what I did. He never once told me that was a good job or you did a good thing. And he said he regrets that he never heard that kind of praise from his father. And that's why I say we have to always build little things in our lives. We have to remember that even if somebody doesn't praise us or recognize us, we are our own best friend or our own worst enemy. There's something worse than somebody else not congratulating us and praising us and encouraging us. It's when we don't do it for ourselves. That's even worse. And so if that man, as difficult as it was all those years, and I hope he did, found a way to praise himself and congratulate himself and say, you know, I think you did a pretty good job there. It would have made a big difference in his life. 